Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Goddess. I'm Nye, and the Twitch chat is here with me as we uh, continue exploring. We've made this place look really nice. We have a really respectable looking city going on. We gained Beautify recently, so I can... Whoa, a bunch of people just died for no particular reason. That sucks. We need to not let that happen. What we need to also do is to open this up a little bit, so that way this altar can be worked on. Let's go ahead and move this out of the way, so these guys can work on this when they get around to it. And uh, that's fantastic. And there's our beautiful looking beautified area. And I'm probably going to need to use Beautify again, because I do have some not-looking-good areas around here. So let's, uh, use that to get rid of that. Just spreading this otherwise, because I just, I can. That was interesting. Now, the other question is, what am I going to use for all the rest of this? Well, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a land bridge over this. So that way we can access... Oh, hello, I see cards. Or do I see... Or, is it, or are those butterflies? Never mind, those are butterflies. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a land bridge across here. So that way we can get to that other really big monument that's over in this direction. And that'll be one of my upcoming goals. Let's move that stuff. Come on, let's go. A little bit more. Better. Okay, because I want to see what that big monument is over here. Because this thing is bigger than most everything else we have in the area. Like, this thing is huge. And I really want to see what it is and what it does. So, I think we're going to try working towards that before we go over to the Mount of the Gods. Because I just remember that this thing's over here and I want to see what it is. And the first step to doing that is to get plots going here so I can get people over here. Because our followers prefer going places if they can make houses there. So that's uh, this gentleman right over here, whoever that is, seems to be heading this direction just for that. I was asked if I can click on the mount, or on that, on that thing to see what its name is, and no. Clicking on it doesn't do anything. So that doesn't help. Let's draw this back a little ways. And then we'll draw this out. And continue making bigger plots. I'm going to pop those two and hope that those people come in this direction. We're going to use a lot of belief just to sculpt this out. Give ourselves some more land over here. It's working pretty well, though. And belief is definitely a renewable resource. Now, while I'm over here, because I see that we have some, uh... Whoa, whoa what the hell was that? That sounded evil. Some clay, it's a resource card. Anybody else hear that? There it goes again. Got some oak. I actually needed oak, so that's going to help me on stone cottages. I'll tell you what it sounds like. It sounds like, uh... Burn Gully and Hexus. Okay, so those guys are building some t uh, buildings down here. We're going to continue expanding here. Okay, it's level two. Can I get a level three building? Level three plot? Span that out. Span this out. There's a level 3 plot. Got some room right here. This is wonderful. We are making so much space. Awesome. Okay, so now I should be able to get plenty of people out here. So the next thing I need to do is get the remainder of these cards that are floating out. Because there's a lot of cards around here. Let's get rid of this stuff. Draw out our plateaus here. Okay, let's hunt down these cards, because I can see them kind of out of the corner of my eye. There's one, like, right here, for example. There's another one. Got some more clay. 
Don't really need that all that much. Clay isn't the most useful thing to me. What I need right now is oak. I saw some more. There it is. Okay, I see it. We're going to let these guys build as much as they can for the time being while we just do our thing. We're a god by collective, apparently. So let's pull that back. Okay. God, there, that, that sound is creepy, and it's every time I expand in this area. What the hell is that? Whatever it is, it is creepy as hell. What is this? Ochre? Okay, uh, did I need that? I don't... Yeah, I needed ochre for architecture. Okay. So now we need two more sandstone to unlock architecture, but we're getting there. Whatever that is that I'm hearing is really freaking creepy, and the developers need to take it out unless it's meant to be creepy. Because goddamn... I don't need that sort of thing in, in my god game. Is there a setting I can do? Like the cr turn off the creepiness meter? Okay, let's expand this out. Give myself room to put peeps here. I don't know if my people are going to want to live next to whatever this is, but we're going we're gonna to try. And there's some space there. Wonderful. Okay, and you guys are ready to birth some peeps. And you're ready to do some work. I do see another card over in this worldly direction. And it's easy to access, it looks like. So let's just drag. And we have immediate access to more sandstone. Wonderful. I only need one more sandstone to get this done. I have no idea. Uh, I'm being asked, or I'm being reminded that the game said there will be a conquest age in the near future. But the game very clearly states that this, the uh, my my home world here, is just for me. Like no other god is allowed to interfere in here, Th like no other player. So the question is, if it's a conquest age, what will we conquer? That's a very good question. I have no idea, and I'm not sure I want to know. Okay, so we're trying to get a population over here, so that way we can start working on. Uh, that. What I'm hoping is that this isn't going to be a bad thing. Like, you know, oh, there's this, uh, there's this amazing artifact out here, and we want to figure out what it is and what it does. You know, I don't want it to be like that. I don't know what this guy's doing. Build, my minions. Build for all your worth, which is admittedly not very much. Expand this out a little bit. Nope. Too far. Build back up. Complete yourself. Good. Dumb house putting itself where I'm trying to build. Okay, we got some more plots building up. Some stairs that my minions can get actually get up here. And we are completely out of faith for the most part. Uh, Mana 2, you got anything for me? No. Triton's got nothing for me, so we're just going to have to go collect some faith from um, the land of happiness and sunshine up here. Which I believe should be the official name of this area. And I will petition for as much. I mean, even the cliff, even the cliffs look happy. Yeah, this is this is totally the land of happiness and sunshine. That's uh, I am calling it now. Except for those people, they're not getting a lot of happiness and sunshine. But you know, screw those people. Gonna expand this a little bit. Up, oh, I okay. Apparently, we're not going to do that. Okay, let's go check the bottom village real quick, just to see if they're, you know, still having problems down here. How they're doing. Haven't checked on them this episode. Hi, guys. Your god returns to see how you're doing. I know you're blighted. We're going to have to fix that. 
Now, they've got too much blight around here. They're not going to be able to uh, produce much of anything until I get rid of that. Gotta get rid of the swamp. So we're going to have to work on that. Well, that kind of sucks. Too much swamp. Swamp is bad. I, the fact that these guys are just not producing anything. My followers need resources. They can freaking mine on their own. I shouldn't have to do everything for them, should I? Can't do everything for my followers? Can, don't, don't they have free will? Okay, yeah. 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 go fix this. Make something. No, I don't want... No, no, that's not what I... No! Okay, we are getting ourselves tons of followers. I don't know what these ones are going to do, but we're, uh... We're only about 50 followers off of getting our next potential upgrade. And I'd like to get there, so... That's the plan. So let's unlock some more, uh, more land plots for us to work with. Uh, they'll get there on their own. I'm not worried about the totem. Being reminded that I could you totally use a totem to get my followers there. And while that's a complete true statement, uh, I'm feeling lazy. And also the totem just, it costs way too much. I say as I terraform the land out. Costing thousands. Okay, that should do it. Okay, so that'll be some more villagers over there. These guys have got their own thing. These guys are having issues because they have no way to get up here. Okay. And apparently they're dying from it, too. Let's give you a way up here so you don't just die and do nothing. You know, the way you're actually doing. There you go. Enjoy your stairs. There are stairs to get up there. I don't want to hear it. Eventually, they need to have some way of carving things. So that way, I don't have to do all the work. What are you people doing? I don't know what they're doing. Not sure what okay. these guys are doing, but we're going to go ahead and birth pretty much everybody we can get. Because I want to make sure that we're getting activity over on this side of the map. Because basically nothing's happening over here. This is not being built, which was the entire point of this episode. It's not happening because they're lollygagging. I don't want them to be lollygagging. I want them to be gagging less and lolling more. Okay, now they're building it. Okay. Hopefully they'll build faster. It's wonderful. I'm glad that you can point. Okay, let's make some more room. Cool. Okay, we got... No, no, no. No. Back off. Thank you. Okay, so we're now able to... Uh, let's pop that. Pop that. Heal you guys. So now they're working on this temple. Whatever it is, we will know soon. And hopefully it won't be something evil. Because that would suck. I really hope they fix this sometime soon. I don't know what that is, but that actually kind of worries me. Okay, let's expand this outwards a little bit. Give ourselves some more plots. Shouldn't take too long. Except that I am... Oh, we just lost a dude. Don't know what he was doing. I think he got killed. he got killed by something. How are you people dying? What are you doing over here? What is killing you? There's no wolves over here. I can see that. I don't. I don't. I don't know. I don't know what they're doing. Okay, are you guys still working on this? 
I didn't see a wolf. You saw a wolf? I think, uh, I think they're crying wolf. And we know what happens to people who do that. Okay. Their god finger gods them. And I will do it, too. I am a vengeful god. Pop that guy. Okay, let's see. Can you guys do this faster, please? Man, if I couldn't play Goddess, I'd probably be bored, too. Okay, you lot. This temple looks like it's nearing completion. Can we, uh, can we get an estimated time on that? Oh, wait. We got it. Whatever it is, we just got it. I don't know what it is. Okay, they went into it. It looks like a maternity temple. I don't know what this is. The game's not telling me. It's not giving me any information about what it is at all. All I know is people went in and then when they and they left really quickly. I mean, it looks impressive. It looks important. But once more, the game is failing to give me any kind of direction whatsoever. So I guess we're going to be waiting to see, you know, if something changes in the nearby area. It looks like a pregnant woman, so I'm assuming it's like a maternity temple or something like that. And it, cre and it increases the rate of birth in the area. Go ahead and cut down the more trees here. I mean, people... Whenever someone leaves a house, they are immediately running into that temple. That's what it looks like. Well, the I mean the new patch isn't that old. I mean, it, yeah, I mean it's not that new. Came out a couple days ago. So yeah, the new this new patch is not that new. Okay, so we're going to make sure we get to 1,000 followers. We're going to see exactly what it does, and then that's going to be about it for me, guys. Getting close. I mean, we have the 1,000 followers. We're just waiting for them to finish making their houses. But, yeah, I'm, um... I'm thinking that, uh... This just must be a fertility temple or something like that. Can I... There we go. Tell me what this is. Why do I not have a question what this is button? I just lost another follower over here. Is there a wolf just hiding in here somewhere? I don't see no wolf. These people are just dying in this area for no particular reason. Okay. Well, that's weird. On these steps right here, people just die. They don't die for any reason. I think what they're doing is think they're tripping and they're falling flat on their faces and breaking their necks. There's no wolf in there. Okay, real quick before we end the episode, what is this? Pottery. It's a science. We have a lot of clay. I know that. Clay's took taken care of. And meat's taken care of. And kindling? Kindling is almost done. What is this going to do for us? Follower health will increase. Oh, that is useful. Okay, so we need to find a little bit of meat. And then we're going to have pottery completely taken care of. Which is, that's absolutely fantastic. And our next follower upgrade is not going to happen until we have 300 more followers. That's a gigantic amount when you consider I only have 1,000 to begin with. So yeah, we're, uh, we're looking at stuff here. Hey, would you look at that? Are these guys being healed? No? Yeah, kindling. Kindling's what I need. Anyways, that's gonna be it for me, folks. When we return next time, we're probably gonna go to the Mount of the Gods and uh, fight Amy, Dan, whatever AI is messing around there at the time. And uh, that will be about that. Hopefully get this thing completed. Whatever it is me to do. But yeah, folks. I'll see you guys sometime soon.